Welcome to our video set on optimizing your PC. In this video, we'll explore the Microsoft utility Tweak UI. Now, there's a very useful utility that Microsoft provides, and actually, Microsoft provides a huge number of utilities that work with Windows and can really help customize a lot of areas of Windows. But often a lot of these utilities aren't very well publicized at all and you may very well never come across them. For example, such a utility that I'll talk through in this video is called Tweak UI, Tweak User Interface. So just search for that. And OK, the first results, not a very descriptive listing, but that's where we want to go, to Microsoft. And actually, you can just go to Microsoft.com if you want and search for it there. OK, so we're sent to the Microsoft Power Toys for Windows XP page. And there's a whole bunch. So you can download and play around with those if you wish. But what we want in this example is this tweakui.exe. It's a very small but very useful utility. So let's download that. And there it is, Tweak UI Power Toy Setup. So let's double click and install that. And OK, I've installed that and it gets added to the program list in the start menu so you can just access it that way. It provides a huge amount of data about your system and allows you to customize an awful lot. I'm not going to get too bogged down in the details in this video because really we could spend a huge amount of time just going through this. But what I'm going to focus on, it was a personal gripe of mine, and maybe it's been an annoyance to you too, is whenever you insert anything into your computer, whether it's a memory stick or an external hard drive, a CD, a DVD, XP starts scanning it and trying to run a whole bunch of stuff automatically. And I don't like that. I actually like to control the running of programs or the browsing of CDs myself. I don't want it to be done automatically for me. So if that's something you want to change, Tweak UI makes it very easy. Go to My Computer here, you go to Autoplay, and OK, Drives, Types, Handlers. First of all, Drives. Enable Autoplay on Drives. If you uncheck these, then autoplay is disabled, and also types. You can disable autoplay for CD and DVD drives, and disable autoplay for removable drives. So I've done that as well. So that's just one aspect of Tweak UI that I find can make Windows XP a lot more usable. And just very quickly looking through a couple of these, and you may want to look through this further to really customize Windows if you wish. And these aren't really about optimizing Windows, but just out of interest, as you can see, under Mouse, you can change the right-click menu speed. You can change double-click, drag sensitivity, and you can change pretty much everything about how your mouse works. If you go to Explorer here, you can customize an awful lot about Windows Explorer. That's not Internet Explorer, that's Windows Explorer. And OK, this is Windows Explorer, which is really a more advanced feature of my computer, with files and folders on the right and drives on the left. Anyway, let's close that. So you can customize that. You can customize the taskbar and start menu and so on. So it's a very useful utility and as shown there are also many other utilities on that page. As Microsoft calls them, power toys. Those are not well publicized utilities that can really give you a lot more control over almost every aspect of Windows XP. So you may want to play around with this or you may want to play around with any of the other utilities on that page. But I just very quickly wanted to show you the autoplay functionality. I find that very useful when the CD and DVD and external hard drives 
and memory stick don't start automatically. But that's just how I prefer to work, so you can customize an awful lot using these utilities.